Hello, I'm Mr Maths, and today we're going to be looking at Functional Skills Level 2 style question. Now you'll find this on your Basic Functional Skills Level 2 exam. So let's dive right in. So, Amir uses 300 grams of spread to make 25 sandwiches. He buys the spread in 2.5 kilogram tubs. He has no spread left. Next week, Amir wants to make 500 sandwiches. How many tubs does he need to buy? You must show your working out. That's really important that you show all your working out because as you can see at the bottom here, this question is worth five marks. I'll just um, circle that. Okay, so this question is five marks. So it's really important that you show all your working out when doing this question. Okay, first we have to work out how many grams of spread it, Amir uses to make one sandwich. Okay, so what we do is we would take the 300 grams and we would divide it by how many sandwiches he got out of that 300 grams. So we've got 25 sandwiches out of 300 grams of spread. Okay, so let's have a look what that would look like. So, 300 divided by 25 equals 12, so it's 12 grams per sandwich. Just says so, so it's 12 grams of spread per sandwich. So now he needs to make 500 sandwiches. So now we're going to work out how many grams of spread he needs to buy to make 500 sandwiches. So 12 grams. He's got to make 500 of those, so 500 times 12 equals 6,000. So that's 6,000 grams to make 500 sandwiches. Okay, so because we're looking at the smaller units, if you look at my conversion factors video, it shows you that with a smaller unit, you divide by the conversion factor to get kilograms. Okay, so if, if I just show you this, so 6,000 divided by the conversion factor is 1,000 grams for every kilogram equals 6. So that's 6 kilograms. So he's going to need 6 kilograms of spread to make his sandwiches. Now the sandwiches, they come in 2.5 kilogram tubs. So there's a couple of ways you could um, work this out. Really, you could just add up 2.5 plus 2.5 and work out how many tubs he'd need. It's more than likely that he'll go over, but then you'll know how many 2.5s he would need, which is how many tubs he would need to get his 6 kilograms of spread for his 500 sandwiches. So it works out 3 times 2.5 is 7.5 kilograms. Now, if you had 2 times 2.5, he's only going to have 5 kilograms. So he's not going to have enough. He's going to be a kilogram short for making his sandwiches. As you can see at the bottom here, I've given it to you in grams as well. But really, you want to show that you can convert between the units within the system from grams to kilograms. So what he would need is 3 tubs. So 3 times 2.5 kilograms and he's going to have 1.5 kilograms left over so your answer is Amir needs to purchase three tubs okay so just remember you've got to get points for all of these things you're going to get points for that you're going to get a point for that point for this point for this and a point for this so you get Roughly it works out five points for the whole question. Just remember to put all that working out in, okay? And then you're going to get all your marks. I've been Mr. Maths. Please like and subscribe. 